welcome to my channel thank you so much for tuning in my name is Kameka Hassan uh, please do click on the subscribe button also click on the bell so that you're notified each time I post a video in this video guys we'll be talking about products that I have incorporated into my natural hair journey when it's in protective um, style so these products are products I use to moisturize uh, my scalp my hair when it's in a protective hairstyle so you know that protective hairstyles are either braids or condos it's all up to you so i used to explore more with box braids um this was because i felt like there's less tension on the scalp and on the hairline when it's in box braids rather than condos and this is definitely true if you look at my condos right now there's this pulling effect that occurs on the hairline and on the scalp so imagine when you already have hairline issues this is not the best hairstyle or protective hairstyle for you to do um yeah it's not the best protective hairstyle for you to do firstly you need to um sort of maintain your maintain the growth of your hairline or deal with it and then that's only when you can do congrues um so I realized after braiding cornrows that um, this pulling effect causes a headache, guys. I had this weird headache. I took a do, took some water, put it on the head. Um, so that actually took long. So I had to find a product that would help with soothing the scalp, soothing the, the hairline when it's in cornrows or any kind of protective hairstyle. doesn't have to be cornrows only. It can also be box braids. So... I looked for a product from Dark and Lovely because Dark and Lovely actually treats my hair really well. I've used these products from a really young age. Even when my hair was relaxed, I would use Dark and Lovely products. My hair is growing so well and healthy because of Dark and Lovely. So I found this product called the Protective Relief right here. So it's going to moisturize, soothe scalp tensions and visibly reduce dandruffs so you can use it on braids weaves wigs and locks so what i like most about this product is the packaging one all you do is just open it up right here and squeeze the product and it comes out so i use this product applied it you guys will see right here on the side i applied it directly on each and every line of my cornrows immediately when you massage the product you don't have to even harshly massage it yes it looks white when you apply it but when you massage it into the hair it just melts into your scalp which is something i really liked about the product and then a few minutes later what i realized is i felt like a peppermint sensation on my scalp and honestly i don't like products that have peppermint i would rather use a conditioner and a shampoo that has peppermint because i know i'm going to rinse it off I don't want to moisturize my hair with products that have peppermint in it so because I, I really I really I really don't like that uncomfortable feeling you get afterwards but if you're someone that uh, prefers peppermint products or you don't have a problem with like that peppermint sen sensation that occurs on your scalp then definitely this is the product for you so I then went and checked the ingredients of this product and the last one is is peppermint extract in the in the product so that makes sense why i felt that peppermint sensation on the scalp otherwise i really love this product and i will be using it immediately after doing my condos then i will use the product but going forward to moisturize that's not that's not my cup of tea okay um so a product that I also like to use to moisturize my hair is the braid spray. So what I've done is in here, I've mixed three products. So whatever product that comes with the braid spray. And then I've also taken the dark and lovely, what is it called? Um, what is it called? How can I forget it? Afrofruit butter, yes. The dark and lovely Afrofruit butter. I've taken that product also and I've scooped a bit of it into this and I've also put some oil into this into this bottle. Then I obviously mixed it up 
so every time this is what i'm going to use to moisturize my hair okay this is what i use when it's in protective hairstyle because this works better it doesn't have any pepper peppermint so this is really great for me it has a lot of the products that are in here but not peppermint which is great and that's why this is my favorite product to moisturize when uh, my hair is in protective hairstyle so you can get yourself these products either at clicks or at Discam. they're really really affordable this one is about 60 something rand and this one i don't really remember because i've had it for a while but it's also affordable so yeah, these are the two products that i would recommend you guys try out to moisturize your hair when it's in protective hairstyle and again please guys please do not assume that your do not assume that whatever fiber you used on your hair is your hair okay remember one day you will have to take off those braids and you would have to really see your real hair see the condition of your real hair so treat Treat those cornrows or those braids as if they are your hair because obviously your hair is definitely in them. So please, please guys, please moisturize. If you don't want hair issues, if you don't want hairline issues, please moisturize. That is so important. And that's what's been working for me for the past few years. I take care of my cornrows as if they are my hair, okay? Because I know my hair is in it. So yeah, those are the two products that i would recommend you guys to try out if you're not comfortable with trying them out please do not try them out i'm not forcing anyone to try these products because i'm not a hair expert i'm just sharing with you guys my journey and stuff that work best for my hair thank you so much for watching this video i'll see you guys in the next one i love you guys so much okay